Okay. Um, so yeah, so this is, I don't know. They, they said if you submitted a talk with the scholarship, you were more likely to get accepted. So I was like, oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, so this is the talk. Uh, this title is from chat GPT. Um, so yes, uh, about me, uh, I am human, apparently. <laughs> Speaking of the microphone, just like oh, is it on? Maybe it's not on. It's not oh, on. It's not it's on. on. No, no. Right now. All right. Yes. Okay. It's working. Oh, great. Okay. Verified. My voice is recorded. All right. Um. So yeah, I, I did edit Wikipedia. I do edit it. I guess. Um. So uh. But, you know, why do you edit Wikipedia? That was a good question. Um, apparently, there are reasons you shouldn't edit Wikipedia, which uh, I was like, oh, well, there's different reasons. Um, so let me, there, yeah, I don't know why it's showing the bar down here. There we go. That's better. Um, all right. So yeah, I, I guess, the, I mean, I wouldn't say these are the reasons I edit Wikipedia, but they're, I mean, maybe they enjoy editing part. That's certainly, uh, I do enjoy editing it. Um, but I was thinking about alternative titles after I came up with that title with ChatGPT, and I was like, gardening Wikipedia, that's a good metaphor. Um, it has issues though, which is that I don't know what kind of garden it could be. Um, so these are a few types of gardens, and I was like, this one over here with the maze is probably the one most like Wikipedia. <laughs> um, and, uh, and so then I came up with this other metaphor. I was like, Wikipedia is a rope, right? You start with all these sources and you twist the information together and you get this amazing knot um, or well, an article, right? And so then like, you know, the question is, uh, what does Wikipedia actually look like? And the answer is, <laughs> Uh, all right. Um, yes. Yeah, so the problem is not making knots. The problem is that there's so many sources that you don't know what to do with them. Um, and so this is what I wish Wikipedia looked like, is it was just me, like, sitting in a chair and, like, you know, accessing all the information. <laughs> and, um, yeah, um, so I don't know, like I've been, I've been looking around the conference and not many people seem to think that Wikipedia should be a pile of black goop. So um, <laughs> yeah, um, and so, but I, I do think that Wikipedia is a tool rather than a community because people go to Wikipedia for information. Glasses did. What, I'm sorry, someone say something? Oh, maybe. Okay, sorry. Um, we're, we're doing a talk, so I, I'm sure you're yeah. somewhere in there. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, so yeah, and so you know, my, my idea is like, well, you know, we can't get the direct brain computer interface, maybe, but we can follow the well-known principles of UI design. And I was really happy to see the the new redesign a few. I forget, was it last year, two years ago, something like that? Um, and so, but I wanted to go back to the rope analogy and talk about how you untangle things. Um, and so this is a lot of the editing I've been doing is uh, finding duplicated content and then figuring out where it should live and then like just sort of centralizing it into one place. Um, and so this is an example of one of my edits. Uh, I took this uh, Grand Rapids dip, and uh, there were like three places on the Wikipedia where it was. And I was like, you know, the same sources, the same information presented three different ways. And I was like, well, I don't, you know, I'd rather it be in one place. Um, and so I talked with uh, ChatGPT for a long time, and it said, oh, well, you should do it, the article structure this way. Um, this is not the consistent structure. It has like three different structures it proposed, but this was the one I liked the best. So that's what I did. Um, and so then you have this like different structure after you replace it. So you have like the alcohol here doesn't mention the Grand Rapids dip at all. 
And then here it's a link up to a super section. And here it's the main discussion. Um, and I won't get into how I did it. I'll just say that like, it's really impossible, I think, to do that on a mobile device. Um, so I, I really think you need, if you want like three text editors up at once, you need three screens or, three, or half of three screens at least. Um, and I don't really know if it made the page better, but it seems like people edited it a lot more. And yeah, so uh, there's other examples and that's the end of the talk. And all, all the images, so I don't get sued. <laughs> Go back to the examples. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The other examples. Um, yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Next. Okay.